I had to redo this video. But anyways, organized stocking. <clears throat> Delivery trucks. Delivery things. Amazon, UPS, FedEx, all these things could be involved. But this one's more of UPS. Um, anyways, I went to T-Mobile, ordered my phone, right? Brand new, paid it off fully, etc. And um, I had looked online if I can order it and send it to the store and pick it up, right? Because I wanted, it would be safer, I think, with that way. And the guy at the store said uh, I couldn't. He said I had to just get it straight sent to my house. I was like, I looked online, da 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 and I have this on live stream, by the way. My uh, T-Mobile associate, everything. But anyways, um, uh, he said I couldn't send it to the store. Even though I already kind of clarified online, I could. But online, it wasn't letting me do it online. Uh, I was having errors from the hackers. So the guy said I had to send it to my house. I was like, I already the I thought I could send it to the store and pick it up. He's like, no, you got to send it to your house. So T Mobile's was obviously an organized stocking too. But um, anyways, that's why my T Mobile account's hacked. When that guy pulled up my T Mobile account, it said error three or four or some shit, and it was it wouldn't go through. Um, but anyways, um, then uh. I ordered it, got it sent to my house, whatever, waiting for it. And then the UPS guy came. Or no, this is the, the, since I moved here, the UPS and the delivery truck's been honking at my front window and looking in my window every time they pull up. I said something when one of them delivered something and now they don't honk anymore um, because I speak up, right? I'm blunt and, I'm all, <laughs> I'm blunt and honest. But anyways... um. And uh, anyways, they started honking over here and I thought they were trying to set me up for stocking or delivering packages or some weird shit with delivery. Um, scams, for, I don't know. But anyways, um, when they delivered my iPhone, I ordered it, right? And they said I couldn't get it delivered to my house. I mean, I couldn't get it delivered to the store and pick it up, um, which I found suspicious, right? And I have them on live stream saying that shit. And anyways... Uh, they deliver it to my house. The UPS guy comes to my door and and he knocks on my door and he, he clarifies my name and then hands me my phone because uh, my phone's expensive. Right. And. Um, and uh, so I grab it, I open it up, I'm setting it up. It said something about error, or like too many chances or like something like the phone was used before. That's what it looked like. It looked like the phone was already used before when I was. um when I opened it, but I opened it brand new, right, and then I told the, I told one of the T-Mobile things that it did that, and they said I can return it, but then I got sick, so I couldn't get up and return it, so I just kept it, so they could have switched my phone in the delivery truck with a already hacked phone um, from organized stocking, and then I came over here, and they tried to set me up for organized stocking and hacking and all this other shit, and they were trying to set me up, make it look like I knew the UPS drivers and the delivery truck drivers. So they started honking at my front window, like acknowledging me. So that's a connection between my phone hacking, the UPS drivers, the delivery trucks, probably being paid off as paid operatives uh, to set me up and also hack me. But yeah, documentation and theory. Let's go.